Hi folks, well, I tried the sluice to, to glass it and uh, cocked up. I didn't put enough uh, hardener in the resin, but it's not a complete failure. I uh, can uh, do it. It's, uh, I stopped and there's a clip, there's a couple of clips in this. And then I went down to that uh, new river uh, or new stream and had that a try and didn't have much success there but there's a few clips I did find some gold but not uh, as good as I did last week which was strange so what I'll probably do is go back to that spot where I went last week and sluice that but I'll do some more tests on this place at a later date uh, I got laid off this week until January I do say February in here but I got laid off till January so that was a bit of a pain in the arse as well but anyway I'll get on with it it's been a crap week it is nice to be nice though so guys, I had a problem. <laughs> I used polyester resin and I didn't put enough hardener in it. Now, I started and then I abandoned the attempt after finding out the problem. Um, there's a measuring thing on the tub, but there's nothing to measure the hardener and uh, you're supposed to put 2% uh, in now on the last mix I brought my scales my gold scales to actually weigh it which I should have done in the first place the good news is that I've got enough material to go again looking at this I quite like that but it is a real pain to put it on because it's uh, it's quite stiff and when you're trying to bend it it wants to flip up even with resin now whether that had worked if uh, whether it'd have stuck down better if I'd have put it on uh, with a proper mix of hardener is another thing but I'm gonna attempt again so today I'm going back up to that river and gonna do some more testing this will get done next week as I say I have got enough of this and enough fiberglass uh, I might try again to find some powder but I've, everywhere I've looked here I, I can't find it and there is an art shop but it's uh, it's an hour's drive so one way so it's a two hour trip if I go and buy uh, material for it the, the powder and I am wondering if I could do it with charcoal powdered charcoal but I don't know I might do some tests first as I said the plaster might come out with it it has done but it would come off but it just weren't hardening up properly oh well plan b do it again the only place that came off look is this here which you can see again <laughs> only thing i'm gonna have to try and do is clean all this unset resin off mm have to look at what I can use to do with that that's that bank there's not a lot of water today but the reason that bank's there is because this other stream comes through under the road so that probably the best place to test there or on that side and there's also that curve there but I'm gonna do that on my way back I'm gonna walk up and see where it gets a bit away from the road and just see if I can do a few pans and we are dumb questions if anyone asks me on the end of the day because I'm only going to be here a couple of hours bit of mental hygiene due to the fact I got laid off on Friday which is normal at Christmas just a few weeks more would have been good I've got another building site on uh, second week of February so although I will be looking for other work in between some interesting bracket fungus But it doesn't go away from the road. The road goes around there and follows down side at road. So I'll just do a few pans, see what we get, and give you a look. Try that corner there.
So there is one micro fine piece in there. surprising because if you look where I am here the river comes there comes all the way around so I'm betting when rivers really high it's just sort of smashing all over there so well, that side of that or well, that side of that's probably going to be better than here itself although it's a big curve some lighter stuff might be moving down there but I'm gonna do one test up there and then I'll know where I've stopped and then I'm gonna work my way back to the car and uh, just keep doing tests and see what I find Right then, I've had three out of here, and no gold from both sides and in the middle. So, and my theory, well, my theory, what I found with, with streams that run like that, it can be anywhere, it doesn't sort of concentrate. There's another place, yeah, a few, few miles away from here, and it's, it's quite a lot of water, but it's really flat and windy. It's got gold in it, but it doesn't concentrate in any particular place. Or I haven't found where it concentrates yet. So I'm going to start walking down. That looks better on way down because the stream runs sort of straight. Whit road. And obviously it drop as it drops. And there's all these other little places that run into it. Further down there as well. Here as well. But that's assuming that's where gold's coming from out at land. And into river from... All these little tributaries so there's likely to be more gold anywhere down there than there is up here two pans there's two really 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 tiny pieces there and I took another I've got one more I just took one from there and one from there I took one from there and one from there they'll want it first that sort of size so it's not looking good really where I tested before last week was just up there about I don't know there's a tree stump somewhere up there my fingers pointing to it on the end of my finger or about up there and pieces were bigger so but I'm losing light now so I'm gonna walk down a bit and then test that bank where I were before what I said and uh, have a look on there and call it a day it's half past three just a bit of a walk and a bit of a test it'd be nice if I could find a, a hot hot spot but there you go well rubbish <laughs> Did a test there, took one there, took one there. It's not to say there might be something in here, but I've just found, found that just that tiny little speck stuff. Really, really flower, flower gold. Not like I found last week, which is quite strange. So, if anywhere, I'm going to start next year. And if I do come here, because it's not looking that good now, must have been beginner's luck last week, but I'll go back up to that spot and sluice it and see what it does. I might come back down here. I've got a lot of time on my hands now. Well, not a lot, but some time on my hands. Got some stuff to do in house, but as I'm not working for a bit, then I'll do some further tests, but it's gonna get dark soon, so. And I wanna pick some mushrooms, just to go and see what they are. If I can ID them, 